As an occupational therapist, I'm always reflecting on my practice and whether I'm practicing in a way that is affirming, that is compassionate, ethical, trauma-informed, um, and supportive. I also try to think about the intersectionality of neurodivergence and other facets such as gender identity and race. Being able um, to be present with clients in a way that is meaningful to them and supporting them so that they can participate in the activities that make their life meaningful and joyful is what truly makes my work fulfilling as a professional. I also have family and friends who experience many challenges due to their neurodivergence, their race or their gender identity. And this has taught me a lot about the real lived experiences of people and how challenging it can be just getting through a day. I hope that I can support people in making participation in daily activities just a little bit easier so that my clients may have fewer challenges that they have to navigate in their everyday lives. I'm really grateful that I have the opportunity to learn by listening to the lived experiences of neurodivergent individuals, therapists, um, educators, healthcare providers, and parents. Um, I'm always trying to learn more about the intersection of neurodivergence and other factors like gender, culture, or race. I try to use a trauma-informed lens in my practice because I appreciate that many neurodivergent individuals have experienced various traumas throughout the course of their lives. And that makes this work even more meaningful to me. I really enjoy collaborating and partnering with my clients and their support partners so that we can all work towards a future society, hopefully that is affirming of all neurotypes.